Hey everybody, it's Shannon from Metro Dolls, and I'm doing a first impression of Fontaine Fallow Heart uh, from Monster High Frightmares. Um, I'd have to say, out of all the centaurs um, in this line, she is my absolute favorite. Um, as you can see, I like her horn or antlers, and um, the only thing that I guess my only complaint would be with these dolls is their shirts are molded on and they don't have actual fabric clothing so you can't you know really change it and for customizing wise um, it just kind of limits what you can do <clears throat> but I'm definitely going to get another one of these um, to keep and this one here will be customized um, but, and I'll probably be buying several more uh, to customize as well, just because I love her ears and um, antlers and everything. So, I really like the artwork on this. Um, I just, I think she's really beautiful. Um, and so, I'm going to quick see how easy it is to get her out of this package. And I'll be right back. Okay, she wasn't too hard to get out of the box. I mean, I did it one-handed, so it was a little bit difficult. But, um, <clears throat> a few things. Uh, these birds, unless you leave the uh, elastic around them, they come off very easily. So I could see them getting lost pretty quickly for um, younger kids see just that one just doesn't want to stay on at all this one stays on okay um, but you know it it can come off pretty easily so um, those probably will not be staying on there unless I super glue them on there um, this comes off as well all, all it does is snap off um, and it's cute. I really like the details on it. Um, I think it could have had a little bit more detail in the painting, but you know, I'll fix that myself. Um, another thing that I like is her antlers are actually removable. Um, and this will make it a lot easier when I'm going to, um, well, it's hard to get it out one-handed, but it did come out before for me. There we go. See, it just comes out like that. So, um, that'll be nice for when I'm actually rerouting the hair so I don't have to go around all these awkward antlers and everything. And then I can just pop it back in when I'm done. And then it also makes it nice for painting and everything so um, I really like these um, the details on her belt are really cute um, and on her little leg braces or whatever they are um, I will probably not keep the belt or the or these but um, I like them and I'm not sure if the tail comes out or not. I don't really want to mess with that. But overall, I'm I'm very pleased with her. I think she'll make a great project. Um, and I definitely want to get one to keep in the box. And maybe one out of the box um, for my collection. So I, I give her probably about a 4.5 out of 5 she's she's pretty well I'll give her a five out of five the only thing that I um, could see being a problem for for younger kids is these not wanting to stay on and getting lost um, fairly easy so um, otherwise I am really happy with her I want to know what you guys think of her do you guys have her is she one of your favorites um, which one out of this line is your favorite 
comment down below and if you'd like to see more first impression videos um, I promise that I will get a clearer background and everything I'm kind of under the weather today so um, but yeah um, if you'd like to see more just comment and let me know and I will talk to you guys soon bye